Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John, this is many a true and welcome to Slime Rancher, a game I've got to today because recently I've been making a bit of an effort to try and get to all those games of recent years that everyone agrees are amazing, but I sort of missed at the time. So I know nothing about Slime Rancher. Well, okay, I know three things. One, 60,000 overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam. So, okay, this one's well loved. Two, there's a bunch of cute blobs in it. And three, got this one from the trailer. You appear to interact with the world primarily with a vacuum. That's it. That's all I know. But to be honest, even the title screen has already put a smile on my face. So, okay, I suspect we're in for a good time today. A thousand light years away from Earth on a planet known as the Far Far Range, Beatrix LeBeau begins her first day as a slime rancher. And okay, we're straight into cocking business, got it! Okay, six seconds in, we've already got to everything I know about this game, which is, yes, there are cute things, and I've got a vacuum. Am I supposed to vacuum them? I mean, the illustration indicates I should do, but I mean, do they enjoy being vacuumed? I mean, are they going to have a nice... I really hope he's having a nice time in there. Like, you know, it's nice inside. Like it is inside a Pokeball. It's nice inside a Pokeball, right? I really hope it's nice inside a Pokeball. So, we gather slimes and also... Plorts. Alright. And then we put them into the slime containments. Do they enjoy being in the slime containment? This feels like... This feels like cute slavery. Like, he literally just went over to the wall and tried to escape. When slimes eat, they make plorts. Head over to the plort market. Cash in your... Oh, okay. It's just right. Um, waste, is it? Got it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. These guys just make, uh, plorts. All right. So you just go in there. Presumably this place is going to be full of... Okay, if that's not a plort, then... Okay, one of them might be bleeding... I'm just going to assume that these guys all really enjoy being in captivity because, oh, that was also, I've got a chickadoo. I mean, they look pretty happy. If they start looking unhappy, I will let them out. Okay, I promise, though, when you say activates. Ooh, okay, high walls, music box. Ah, okay, yes, though, oh, blimey. The fact that you need a music box to, yeah, reduce slime agitation implies that without it, there is slime agitation. Okay, I'm feeling slightly ethically uncomfortable with this cute slime game. Okay, the Slimepedia says slimes enjoy being around ranchers, so I'm sure it's all fine. And uh, what we need to do is, uh, yeah, feed these guys. Feed them, then they produce stuff. So hang about, hang about, hang about, hang about. Would you guys like a chicken? This is based on that bit in Jurassic Park where, you know, they put the goat in the Tyrannosaurus enclosure, but like cuter. And also on this occasion, you guys aren't really... Okay, they don't seem to be too interested in eating the chicken. Maybe they don't want to eat the chicken. Maybe I should put the chicken somewhere else. Here we go. I'm going to set up a coop. So now we've got a brand new coop and you guys uh, can just chill out in here. Well done. So hang on, there's all, there's more of you. Right, so all of you coming in here, you work for me now and I really hope the vacuum doesn't hurt them. And if I want to go to new areas, I need giant piles of money. So, okay, 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 okay. What I need to do is feed these bastards. Feed them and that will produce plots. Plots mean money, money means expansion. Aha! There's a handful of stuff here, so... Carrots! Right, guys, it's cocking dinner time and okay. Now, they definitely wanted that. Then they produced the, um, the plorts and then, okay, I want that. But no, no, I didn't mean to suck you up, actually. Sorry. Uh, there, you, there you go. No, 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 not, not like that. Like, there you go. Sorry about that. And then just dump them into the market. There's money, but I'm going to be needing a lot more than that. And I'm going to be needing... Uh, more slimes, uh, more food. Okay, 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 okay. Time to go out into the world, I suppose. 
Right, guys, I've got bad news about your um, levels of freedom. Because actually I'm going to be needing all of you to be coming with me. There we go, lovely. Seriously, I hope you guys enjoy living close together. Because you're all about to be. And as I need money, here you go, have some cocking carrots. There you go. Least I can do, given I've just enslaved the lot of you. And no, this one. There we go. Admittedly, how am I going to... Okay, sucking up the plots without sucking up the, um, the actual guys. Okay, the best option might just be, I'm just going to suck up everything. I mean, this feels a little bit on the monstrous side. But you know what? It's fine. They're smiling. It's not a problem. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So that there, that's a big old pile of plots. So that's like 10 gold to go. Also this, ooh. Okay. There's nighttime ones. I'm guessing you're only coming out at night. Phosphor slimes, la -de da And we've also got one other new thing, which is a, a rock plot belonging to a hangabout, buddy. Hangabout, I just saw you on the move. No, no, you're coming with me. You're coming with me, buddy. One rock slime. Okay, they are all totally metal. Oh my goodness. Okay, the game's nothing but puns, I approve. Right, you're coming with me. You're coming with me too, buddy. And oh, okay, you're a Largo. A large slime hybrid when one slime eats a plot unlike its, ooh, crossbreeding monstrosities. Okay, there is going to come a point where this level of, you know, slimes in one containment is going to be unethical. And I may have already reached that point. In fact, I think they might have started organically escaping. Because they're sort of... Yes, they're now bouncing off each other. And occasionally just sort of uh, getting out and... Oh my goodness, they... They sometimes just give each other rides. That's adorable. Okay, so no. No, 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 you can't have that. That's mine. Naff off. Are you trying to eat a chicken? And... Uh-oh. I think we might be about to see... Yeah, I think we're seeing nature taking its grim awful okay so you are now you're now eating that chicken okay don't don't let them eat the chicken don't let them eat the chicken maybe just don't let them get in there they're trying to eat the chicken oh that's what they're doing they're crowding so they want to okay this is this is rapidly becoming monstrous and i regret everything okay just no get in the container i think we need to yes put up better defenses to keep the chicken safe here we go, double high wall for 350. But for the time being, best thing we can do is probably... I need to be inside that. That. Yeah, let's get the garden set up. So I've got a regular supply of food. Oh my goodness, wait. I found a tabby slime. Okay, that's, that's it. That's the entire game right now. I must develop tabby slimes. And then cross tabby slimes to find the cutest possible tabby slime variants. Okay, dump fruit in garden, just one, and then just starts growing by itself, which is bloody convenient. And then, is that already all ready to go? Although, okay, possibly it takes a bit longer than that for the fruit to be ready. Okay, fine, fair enough. But okay, check the board here, because yeah, basic plots are not worth very much. But, if I were to just feed food to, yeah, the glowy lads at night, or the rock lads... That's worth a lot more, so okay. Let's go get some food and make some money. All right, kiddos, here your cocking go. So you guys just eat all of that and plots. And the phosphors, I can just let them chill out on my farm without worrying about the chickens. Because no, no, the chickens. Okay, so what I was about to say is yes, the phosphors, they're vegetarian. So, unfortunately, these guys aren't. These guys just ate all my cocking chickens. So that's... That's great. Thanks, guys, you stupid pink bastards. The rock slime also wants veggies. Tabby, however, is a carnivore, which is going to be a problem because I can't even keep bloody basic pink slimes out of my hands. So yeah, my ranch is right there. Then we got this big area. There's a tiny area where I found my tabby over in that direction. So, all right. Keep on keeping on, have an explore, look for food. So around this way we have got ourselves a, an island with... Don't know if there's actually a way to get back up from where I am. Kind of hope there is. So over we go. And you, buddy, are... I don't know. 
a pink dodo. And I can... No, 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 no. That, that was the wrong button. All right. Well, can I feed you a carrot? Okay, he seemed to enjoy that. Can I also suck up not mushrooms, though? How about this fruit? There's loads of fruit here. I'm going to feed uh, the pink gordo. I don't know what that does, uh, but it feels like the sort of thing he's appreciating. He's definitely getting bigger. I mean, we're back over in this direction. Take a left, a loop round over to here. Oh, seriously, the movement speed is uh, a lot, and this is... Ooh, a map thing. Okay, I found map data. Lovely. Then we have got ourselves... Uh, your, uh, ooh! Alright, chill out, buddy. I'm guessing that guy doesn't want to be captured. And as a result, goes into defense mode if need be. Okay, chicken dudes, you're coming with me. I can't keep you safe on my farm. So, to be honest, my plan is kind to feed you to Tabby. And we've also got, same area, a cave with a note. Okay, hang on. So, cave system sealed off by cave-in. Alright, some of the guys' heads are grumpy. All right, bring food uh, to calm them down. So ahead, uh, there's something nasty. But if I just blast them with a bit of food, uh, okay, yeah, there you go. Here you go, guys. Have some, have some food. Have some, have some food. Yeah. Okay, and that makes them chill out. Good, 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 good. They were just peckish, which gets me to. All right, I need a slime key to open the secret Skyrim slime door. All right, look out for a slime key, got it. What I should really do is, yeah, try and feed uh, this little guy. Because you want fruit, don't you? No, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to feed you. I know you eat fruit, buddy. I know you eat fruit and... Right, well, okay, hang on. I can feed the hybrid ones. The hybrid ones will produce both. So, okay, there you go. There you go, buddy. So he eats that. He now should produce double thing. So he produces that and... Oh, no, no, don't don't suck over the ones with spikes. That that can end badly. I just want that, to be honest. Yes. No, oh, I can't have that. Okay, this is this is fine. Instead, just... Ow, dick. Okay, just put food over all of these guys. Because there's a bunch of hybrids in this part of the world. So I'm just going to feed them. And that is going to produce... There we go. That's what we need. Now, now I can start hoovering up the rock stuff. Oh, I'm going to be cocking rich at the end of this. Ow! Stop it. There we go. Up to 430 after clearing out all of that. The pink slimes are just... Oh, bloody hell. You guys are just... Right, these guys are trouble, as it turns out. Okay. Okay, I think we need uh, high walls. Everybody back in your cooking cage. That is enough freedom for the lot of you. Everybody get out of my cooking orchard. And also, Tabby, have you eaten? Okay, Tabby's not eaten slimes. Slimes don't count as meat, I don't think. And we're going to feed little Tabby a chickadoo. So if we just put a chickadoo there, Tabby should now eat the chickadoo, right? Because you eat meat. Maybe she wants, like, a grown-up one. You can just wander free. That's fine. You want fruit. I know you want fruit. You want, ah, veggies. It's a carrot a veggie. Carrot might be a veggie. I'm not 100% sure. So, all right. That's, that's fine. All right, just clear the slimes out of here. Leave the chicks in here. And these guys have got their own upgrades. So, again, protect them a bit better. Alternatively, make the chickens, ooh, grow twice as fast or have a little grass so chickens produce more eggs. Okay, I'm guessing somebody needs eggs. To be honest, I'm mainly keeping you to feed to Tabby. Oh, blimey. Uh-oh. Um, okay. Hang about. One of the pink slimes uh, who'd already eaten a phosphor, I think just ate, ate something else and now, now they've become mean. Okay. Hang about. Awful ravenous rainbows. And oh blimey, just took a bite out of me. Well, you, sir, you're going in the cocking ocean. Goodbye. Right, problem solved. Also, that reminds me, there was the giant mega slime over here who I did kind of want to feed. So you, sir, may have additional carrots. How much more food do you want? Because you're definitely getting bigger, aren't you? 
think you are. All right. And then more, more fruit. And oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. John! I feel like I made the key! I have found the key! Oh, so I don't really need the, the slimes, to be honest. Okay, um... I just meant to feed him. I didn't mean to, like, you know, destroy him. Right, okay. Get over there and tell myself to a buzzy ornament. And then, oh my goodness. You are a pink tabby hybrid, aren't you? Oh my goodness, yes. Yes, you can have, John. That's, that's your ornament. Stop throwing your ornaments at them. So, you want meat, or possibly you want meat or anything... Because the whole point is, you're a hybrid of the two. Yes, there you go. So that leads to two distinct types of... Don't let anyone else eat that. Might go wrong. Uh, okay, just, just toss those away. That's got to be worth a bit more, right? Okay, meanwhile, back home. Yes, Tabby would now like to eat the chickens. But Tabby cannot currently get into the chickens. And you're just sort of rolling around doing your own business. So, okay. I feel like we need to set up a proper enclosure for Tabby at this point. I am just shy of that, though. There we go. A handful of pink plots just around the corner will do the job. One of those guys has almost managed to escape. I mean, well done that, lad. Well done. But no, there we go. Just get you down, please. Too many, and there's a risk they- No! The tabby! It ate her- a... Uh-oh. It, it's- We've got- We've got trouble here. You've managed to escape into the thing, as has tabby. Oh, dear. I've decided I've got too many of you. Some of you are now being released back into the wild, so you stop trying to escape. And activate one new little pen. Good. And there we go. The pure tabby slimes shall be put in here. Um, now, as for you, original Mega Tabby, um, I mean, do you actually eat? Oh, bloody hell, Tabby's already escaping. Okay, no. No. You stay down here. You do not eat the chickens until I say you eat the chickens. There's some Tabby plots. All right, that's good. That's very good. And now we leave the chickens alone because we need them to lay more eggs so there's more chickens in future. Admittedly. Okay, does the giant pink tabby still want to be like, you know, eating meat or not? I don't know. Also, buddy. Buddy, buddy, buddy. I'm going to give you a carrot right now so I can have that plot. Because now we must create hybrid tabbies to determine which is the cutest. All right, and now we have got Blue Rock Tabby. I'm going to be honest, she's not as cute. I don't think she's as cute. But all right, okay. Then there's, I definitely shouldn't make Flying Tabby. I feel like Flying Tabby would be a mistake because Flying Tabby will just escape. Okay, next harvest is ready back home. In which case, lads, don't panic, it's cocking dinner time. And thus, vegetables become money nice and easy. Though, obviously, I'm driving the prices down, aren't I? Yeah, the price is being driven down because I'm flooding the market. There's natural economy going on. Back to the cave because, yes, one, you guys are all... No, you're not friendly anymore, but that's fine. I'm just going to run past you. I'm really cocking fast. To the key door. So, all right. Here we go. Key opens door. No Skyrim puzzles, it turns out. This brings me to a quarry where there might be new types of McJibble. Uh-oh, there's- No! No, you monster! No, 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 no. You're all coming with me. All right, you monstrous creatures are going over in the water. No, 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 not you. You're- I don't know what you are, but you might not be evil. Right, into the water you go- Oh, there's more of them, yeah, okay. Back into the water you go- Situation resolved? I think so. Good. Okay. There's tar monsters and they're bad. Definitely. Oh, hello. What on earth are you? Pink boom. Oh, okay. So you guys are um explosive, are you? Hang about, hang about. Now I'm having one of you. And pink boom. Okay. 
somehow they're crossbreeding to become explosive. That is pink crossed with explode. But where's the basic explode? All right, just keep feeding them the carrots. And oh, well, that's a bit of explode, sure. Okay. I'd say you want to be fed, but you kind of don't. Because if I do feed you, you kind of explode. And yeah, because you're rock, you don't want fruit or meat. You just want veggies. Ah, hang about. It says. So, oh, didn't mean to just kill you, but fine, whatever. It says here, these guys will eat anything. It's not just veggies anymore. The pink is like the dominant allele. So as a result of being half pink, they will now eat everything. So just pop some stuff on them. Just feed them if at all possible. And then, yep, they're going to start producing what we need. Come on, there you go. I'm, I'm trying to give you everything. And then occasional explosions too. So, yep, there's proof. That guy just ate a fruit and produced the rock plot anyway. So, okay. I see. I see what we got here. Though, again, the problem we've got right now is... Lack of original explosive. So, alright. Where do we get the... Oh, what's that? I don't know. Okay, Pink Boom Larjo. You're coming with me for a moment. Because when I say that... Um... Have I trapped myself? No, I think I can loop around this path to get back to uh, where I want to go. But I want you on your own away from these bastards. Because I need you to drop some plot that I can actually utilize. So here we go. Just loop over the top here. Then back to here. This is, yeah, this is where we started. Okay, buddy. You just stay over there. And I found a cube berry in a box. Now, the rock lad is not going to want that because it's not a veggie, it's a fruit. And you eat everything. So why ain't you eating this? There we go. We got it. We had to shoot it into his mouth. So uh, hang about. I have now got a boom plot. So now, presumably, explosive tabby. Right, tabby, how would you like one boom plot? And I have now got explosive drooling tabby. Huzzah. Right, okay. I feel like right now, there's enough chickens right here. All right, because you've already laid the next generation. So we got four tabbies. I'd say that means four hens. So you guys can just go back over here. And tabby, it's dinner time. And here we bloody go. There we go. Everybody get some lovely, lovely stuff. Okay, hang on. No, you need to you need to be not not here because oh, tabby. Ta that tabby needs to come with me so it doesn't eat the wrong thing. Okay. Then we need to absorb all of this before anybody else eats it and maybe becomes a tar monster. Okay, maybe just get rid of that. Get rid of the pink plot. We don't need that. There we go. Okay. Now Tabby can go back in her box. Good. Good, good, good. Job done. And this time maybe, yeah, don't go through the cave. Head straight on because there's a, there's a path up here. And to be honest, you guys have just been eating non-stop. So apparently there's just, yeah, giant piles of uh, plot around here. I mean, uh, I won't say no to a free stack of plot. And by the way, you are bad. I'm not 100% sure why, but you are. So that means you need to go in the water, naff off. So, through this area, hang on, check the, check the map here. There's my ranch, yep. Yeah. All right, so I'm now looping round to the left from there. So in which case, hang about, what have we, what have we got in this part of the world? Ooh, trees and so many tabbies. Yes, I found Tabby Island. Okay, get, get all the tabbies before they, you know, accidentally turn themselves into something else. And you are Stony Hen. Because hang about, hang about, hang about, hang about. It said Tabby's favorite food was Stony Hen. And yes, some of these chickadees are also stony. So all right, get rid of you. And we want to keep you. You're a stony chick. So some chicks are stony, some aren't. And I'll be having you as well. Yes, we're going to be wanting to bring these guys into the rotation. So Tabby gets her favorite foods. 
Here we go. The tabby pen, i.e. for the original pure tabbies, uh, shall be kept right here. So it's a bit further away from the chickens, and it's also closer to my house, so I can come and cuddle them at night. And straight away, it's getting high walls. So uh, basic tabbies now go in here. There you go. Good tabby slimes. And then we just mix in stony hens and also the old stony check. And we compensate by pulling out the old hens. Because yes, presumably stony hens leads to stony chicks. So we want to be thinning out the population a bit here. Uh, just two do as a starting point. And all of you may now eat. So one, two, three. Though I don't actually have the space for this thing. Thing right now. But if that stays, that doesn't really matter. Oh no! No, it did matter! Oh no! My explosive tabby. Okay, well that, that's fine. I can just make I can just make more. I can just make more. Okay, so it's actually important the pink one, or rather if the pink one did do that, I need to pick up the poo immediately. Because if I don't, oh no. That was sad. A tabby just went evil. Okay, well, I have got a spare boom plot right now. So, all right, one of you, you're coming with me. Just one, just one, please. One volunteer for the tabby experimentation. So you go over there, and then we put you right there. And then you, you're going to eat that, aren't you? You're going to be a good cat and eat the boom plot. Anytime you're ready. Any minute now. Anytime you eat the cocking plot. There we go. Good. Right. Now back in the thing with you. I'm not sure what encourages them to occasionally form little stacks, but it's very adorable when they do. So, all right. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just get all the vegetables out here because it would appear that I'm pretty much done with every area I can access for now, aside from the ones I pay for. The only thing I can do at this point is, uh, yeah, I think, feed one of the two uh, giants. So, hang on. No, no, no. There's also, uh, there's also this way. All right. Beyond the big blue lad uh, who just wants vegetables, we've got ourselves, ooh. Okay, a new variant. Right, well, all right, just toss some pinks over there. Hello over there. Who are you bastards, precisely? A rad slime? Okay, so that's potentially going to cause trouble in the long run. And you're a basic. Okay, a boom slime. You want meat and you also do explode, yes. I mean... Okay, hang about. Let's learn more about the rad slime, if I stand too close to it. Okay, so don't stand too close to it. It will kill you. Marvelous. And uh, we're going to maintain a guard of them. No! You... Oh, bloody hell, there's a lot of... There are a lot of tar monsters. This might be one of those too many tar monsters type situations, actually. Because I don't see a place to just shove them out of the way. So, okay. The tar monsters have taken this area. Not a huge amount we can do about that. Bit of a shame, really. Right, just sprint straight past them while they're eating all the other helpless bastards. That's all absolutely a-okay. And Oh, bloody hell. Seriously, there's, there's a lot of them. Okay. Luckily, I'm really cocking fast. So, just get over to here. Keep on keeping on. So, a little thing right there. Beyond the bridge... Where are we going? Oh, we're not going anywhere. Not just yet, anyway. And the note from Hobson. He'd come here for a soak and sometimes catch a puddle slime. Okay. What's a puddle slime? Because, okay, uh, I'm kind of out of space. So I can catch more pink plots. Pink plots are not a problem. Just shove them out the way. Is this... Plot. All right, that's a new tabby for the experiments. And there we go. I think you, buddy, are... Yes, a puddle slime. You're coming with me too. Because we can just, you know, give you some water. That seems nice and easy and legit. So uh, keep one in your boot. You'll always stay cool. Okay, that's definitely monstrous. Okay, let's put the rad slimes uh, nice and far away from everybody else as they are literally 
you know, radioactive biohazards. So you guys just stay right here all together. And you guys want... No. No escaping. No escaping, please. These guys want carrots. That's what they want. So let's just put some carrots in there. That should be enough for everybody to be fed, right? Yep. That's everybody fed, I think. So we'll just leave them a little bit more. Now they do... They do slightly kill ya, which I'll admit is, is a downside to them. Uh, just nipping over here. There we go. Just just get some of that nice and fast. That's, that's a lot of rads. Problem we've got here is... Ooh, 63. Not bad. Not bad at all, actually. Aside from one. Keep one on one side because the experimentation must... Okay. The tabbies appear to be, I think, hungry. Which is really sad, but all right. Uh, let's just get one of you. That's No, that's a carrot, John. They don't care about carrots. One plot. All right, someone is going to become a Mega Tabby. So just pop you down right there. There we go. Mega Tabby. Mega Tabby's got to jump on her. Okay, so that there is, yep, yeah, Rad Tabby. Hopefully doesn't, like, you know, kill the others, uh, ideally. Now, how many are we have got many stone hands? No, 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 you don't. That's not where you go. Get back with the others. Look, I'm going to come feed you in just a second. Chill the flip out. Now, what I need to do is I need to remove everything that's not a stone hen. All right, because I want just stone hens in the actual breeding pool. So that's all of you. And now what we do is we're going to feed the tabbies because the tabbies seem to be desperately hungry. So there we go for five. Now, I appreciate that means some of you don't necessarily get to eat. But like plenty of you do. I might go and get some more. I don't have enough chickens to keep my... Oh, this is sad. I can't keep my tabby population fed at the moment. That's that's just not not working. So, okay. Are you guys... How long you guys are hungry? Well, you're smiley right now, so I think you're fine, right? No, that's a... Didn't actually mean to do that. Okay. Uh, may have just accidentally played a bit of God. Didn't mean to play God on that occasion. So, uh, hens laying eggs twice as fast. That's more chickadees. Uh, so, that's good. Uh, right. Then the vitaminizer would get me, yeah, those chickadees uh, to be chickens faster. So, that, that, that would be good. That would speed up this whole process. And at this point, I'm uh, hoping all the chicks appear to be stony chicks. Marvelous. Okay, I'm going to be honest. The, um... The rad tabbies, I think, are now multiplying because every time a rad tabby eats a carrot, it produces one. I mean, okay, this isn't this isn't ideal in in a way. Uh, I, I see there's there's definitely issues with the existence of the rad tabbies, but like, is it a problem if everybody's a rad tabby? Because yes, large rad tabbies do eat vegetables. So actually, as a crossbreed. They're just fine. It just means, yeah, they produce two things rather than one. So actually, that's that's better. Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. I'm flipping coming. You guys can have yourselves. One, two, uh, yeah, two, three, four. There you go. There you flipping go. And then I just need to hoover up all of this, like, now, before you guys eat that nonsense. And, okay, you guys need to wait over there. Because I need to I need to make sure none of you... No! The cocky boom one again! Bloody hell. Right, just just get get over there. Get in the cocky sea. Alright, you better have... Yep, they've gone over the edge. Give me one additional... Yes, tabby explosion tabby. That can be new explosion tabby. No! No, the entire... Oh, no! The entire tabby breeding pen has gone... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Get in the cocky sea. Oh, bloody hell. No, 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 no. Okay. I feel like everything might have just gone completely, completely wrong. I feel like I might have just lost up a lot of, of, of everything, actually. No, stay out of the tabbies. As long as the tabbies survive and the chickens survive, this is... Oh, cock me! Okay, um, so the survivors of the Great Tar Massacre has turned out to be 
all the chickens. The tabbies did make it over there. Four pink slimes. They were cocking worthless. And all of the rad tabbies, who are now pretty much universally rad tabbies, yes. One pond. All right, this is, this is fine. And the pond is going to be where we're going to keep my one puddle slime. All right, he's just going to chill out there and be no trouble. He's kind of vibrating. There we go, he's chilled out. And he doesn't want feeding. He's just happy with water. So that there, that's fine. Now, I'm about to feed Tabby a puddle plot. Now, I'm going to be honest. I don't know whether that means she's going to be good on land or not. So, I mean, let's let's cocking find out. And someone's going to want to eat that, right? Someone wants to be Water Tabby? Who wants to be Water Tabby? Nope, the Tabbies don't want it. So, okay. Let's just try you guys. You guys want it? Or possibly you just can't crossbreed water with other stuff. Okay, I think you just can't do that. I need to rebuild everything, actually, because I just lost all my tabbies. But in all fairness, rebuilding most of them shouldn't be difficult, though I have just learned a valuable lesson about maybe not keeping all of them in one cage. All right, that there, bad idea. Also, thought. I never once actually blended tabby with phospho. Okay, we've got... Oh my goodness, it's Fairy Tabitha. Okay, so you now need to be isolated to make sure there's no trouble. Either I want everyone to become Fairy Tabitha. Also, can you actually fly? Or are you a bit too heavy? I mean, I'll say, this Tabitha... Okay, this Tabitha can definitely fly a bit. We might just want to put... Yes, an air net. Okay, just to make sure you can't get away. But you now eat fruit. Okay, so that means there's less trouble with the chickens. So just pop some stuff there. There we go. I mean, I'll tell you what. You're pretty damn cute. You are cute, so we could have more of you. Okay, that could be a thing we do, because you're easy to feed. So, uh, having a couple of these bastards, uh, just so, yeah, the tabbies don't go hungry. How about we just have uh, one of you right there? Okay, somebody go and eat that. Somebody. Somebody, please. Come on. There we go. I know you're hungry, but now, now you got a taste for fruit. Now you're fine. Somebody's going to pop you in there with your friend. No trouble whatsoever. And we've definitely got enough stone chickens right now that all of the remaining tabbies, there's only three, you guys can now have a meal. And it's your favourite meal. It's literally your favourite type of hen. So they now produce double tabby things. Oh, yeah. Oh, flipping yeah. There's literally... Okay, whichever one of you is still hungry, I feel like you've brought this on your cocky selves at this point. All right. There is literally a chicken... In the pen with you. I'm going to blast it in its mouth. Okay, where are you? Is it you? There we go. This one was the dumb tabby. I'm treating myself to a jetpack. All right. I can afford a jetpack. I see no reason why I'm not allowed a jetpack. Because, John, that's how you get to the far side of the thing. There was, yes, the thing you couldn't cross. Well, now you've got a jetpack. Okay, I see where we're going. Right, time to gather more vegetables from the various spots. I'm filling up that guy with vegetables. All right, it has got to be done. I am making it through one more door. Oh, there he goes. We did it. We got ourselves yet another murder. Spectacular. Right, break all this, see what we got. And it is just roostros, a couple of buzzy ornaments, and also some form of... What? Is this somewhere else nearby? Or have I teleported to like an alternative dimension or something? Okay, well down this way, there's... Ooh. It's a cave farm. Except it's not open yet. I'm gonna be honest, I was expecting another key. Well, okay. One mystery that I can't solve just yet over there. Okay, and for puddle slimes, I can get some more. But no more than four in total. Otherwise... Yeah, they get shy. So, 
Three or so is a good number. Take a bunch of carrots for the rad slimes. Uh, and yes, now we've got ourselves... Oh yeah, we can... Can we make that jump? Oh, I really hope we can make that jump. Go! Nice. Okay. Now, where the flip am I precisely? There's also a lot of money to be made around here just by picking up the, uh, yeah, the rock plots. There's a lot of rock plots going on. There's also, oh, there's Rocky Rad Lads. That's cute. I like them. Oh, bloody hell. Ow. Okay, just grab all this. This is the good money right here. And then just keep on going around the corner. Got ourselves some lovely lads just chilling out in the water. Then, yep, more stone hands. Just take every stone hand. This is getting... Okay, this is getting a bit mazy. I'm kind of hoping to find my way around to the area I saw before. And yeah, you also want veggies. Okay, so now yet more people who want giant piles of vegetables. No trouble, buddy. No trouble. And around the corner, another teleporter. This one bringing me to... Okay, home. And now I can't... Can't go back. Didn't really mean to do that, but okay, fine. I suppose I did need to come here sooner or later. The poor rad tabbies are actually hungry at the moment. So they need some carrots just to, you know, keep them going. Well done, lads. And as for you, buddy, I have brought you some company. So there we go. That should be plenty of bubble plots. Okay, there was a giant pile of... Wait, what the... What happened to the... Does anybody know what happened to the giant fairy cats that I was raising? Because they seem to have gone. Um, I, I don't a hundred percent know where they ended up. They might have burst. I'm not. I'm not quite sure. Though thinking about it, yeah, there's no reason not to not to promote these guys to be. Uh, full-on half tabbies. They'll still eat anything, right? So here we go. Two tabby plorts off the back of this guy. So you guys just have that. That's now a tabby, but it still eats everything. So I can just feed these guys uh, whatever, just more fruit. And now, uh, yeah, they'll just produce tabby plorts, which are a lot more valuable. I mean, I know they're a bit basic, but they're kind of my favourite, in a way. Tabby and basic slime is seriously cute. And as the most valuable thing is, yeah, the lava tabs, then honestly, may as well just have all of you be lovely hot lava tabs. Because you eat the same thing, you're still just uh, carnivores, but this way I just get more stuff. So when I actually feed you... Okay, so the ranch is now nothing but variants of Tabby. It is now pure 100% Tabby and I could not be happier. And just one quick run through... Yeah, the Puddles and the Rad Tabbies gets me such a ridiculous amount of money. Enough money, in fact, to fund an expansion. Because I'm almost out of space, so there we go. My ranch is now bigger than it once was. In fact, this place just seems to be generating chickens. Yep. Okay. Tabby is going to be cocking thrills. And there might be an entire... Oh, there's so many chickens. There's so many chickens in this part of the world. This is going to be marvelously good news. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I get the point on this one. This is... This is just a marvelous, magical tabby adventure where you just basically crossbreed cat blobs with whatever the hell you feel like and make cat monstrosities and they're adorable and everything's just, everything's just great. It's, it's a wonderful, wonderful time. So, okay, I feel like this one would make a really, really beautiful chill live stream game of just breeding more and more tabbies forever. So, okay, watch this space. This is coming back soon because this is, uh, oh, this is just charming. And, uh, okay, plenty of exciting stuff to come. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been Slime Rancher. Thank you very much and goodbye. Were we doing virtual reality or was that just like a metaphor for lesbian sex? And then he smacked me lightly across the face with the money! What? This is... Well, where is this going? What's happening? We're gonna buy a whole new bin and we're gonna write Brendan on it and we're gonna put him in it and toss it off the pier.